And we are back, and we're going to be going over common oscillators. Now, these are common, these are traditional and basic. And we're going to be going over pulse width. Don't let that second part scare you. It's quite quite simple. So now we know um, uh, what an oscillator is. It's basically just a bunch of vibrations per second uh, corresponding with the key you're pressing. Uh, and they can be different shapes. So the first one is simple. It's very simple. It is a sign. And that is, uh, there's no upper harmonics. It's just very, very simple. And uh, these are used in a lot of things. They even use them um, in testing. And there's uh, sine wave generators. And that is a sign. Uh, we have uh, one of my favorites, the most common, uh, it is a saw uh, or sawtooth. There's a ramp up, you can see uh, here. You can see right here, it's, it's a ramp up um, and it's slightly smooth. Different synths have different kind of ways these go into, but I'm going to get into that later. Um, so it's, it's a ramp up. There can also be a ramp down, um, but they're usually just up. Uh, and this is a saw, a saw wave of doom. Um, and they're used quite a bit in bass lines, uh, and they have uh, a lot of harmonics. And that is a saw. It's just, it's just an up ramp or down ramp, like a sawtooth. There you go. Uh, this is a triangle. It's a mixture of a saw and a sign. And it looks like a triangle, right? Looks like a triangle. Uh, it's quite simple. Um, and that is just another one. We also have a square. Now, uh, you would think that this would be a perfect square. Um, and in most cases it is, but in a lot of modern sense, squares aren't really used. Um, for some reason, uh, it's a mystery to me, uh, but they don't actually show up as perfect squares on it. Um, it's something to do with uh, negative pressure. So you have this line here, so you have a positive pressure voltage and then a negative pressure. You can have, you know, it going just one way. Uh, you can with a rectifier, but that is uh, a little advanced. So we have a square, a square quote unquote. Kind of looks like a saw, but with a square built into it. Um, looks rather interesting, but it's not a square. So a lot of times your squares aren't really squares, but it's a very uh, hollow and woody kind of sound. And that would be your square, quote unquote. Uh, and uh, squares do something called uh, pulse width, remind me. I'll get into that later. We'll get, we'll get into that later. Um, your triangular saw, it's not that common, but it is in south one, which is probably what you'll be using. So it's a, it's a triangle wave and a saw wave kind of stacked up. Uh, and then we have one of my favorites, uh, and it is not so much an oscillator, it's just a random, randomizer thing. It's white noise, and uh, there's white noise, pink noise, and brown noise. Uh, the uh, white noise is pure. Uh, Pink is uh, high passed and the brown is low passed. And uh, that is noise, basically. So, uh, with that being said, I'm going to explain. So, those are your, your basic building blocks. Uh, and what synthesis is, is you, you, you know, you kind of mix and match them together. So, uh, we have uh, the Axis Virus, which is industry standard. Notice, notice how the sine wave is kind of opening and closing. Just remember that. Remember that for later. So it's moving slightly. Um, but yeah, just remember that for later. Uh, so we're gonna have a square wave, square wave, quote unquote. Slightly different, uh, but we're going to be uh, closing um, one of the one of the square bits to create a pulse wave 
and uh, this is uh, the pulse width and you can modulate this but it's pulse width which uh, creates uh, it alters your square wave and you can see it up here uh, and in the analyzers and I'll do that right now right we're moving it over and we're kind of closing the gap And you can go so far to create a silent oscillator, which is very interesting. So the pulse width is completely closed shut. And this is a great way to create uh, upper harmonics and to uh, do some neat things. Uh, and you can do some nice stuff with uh, pulse width. Uh, and it's just changing um, the timing no, not the timing. It, it's changing the the duration of the pulse uh, from a square, and yeah, that's basically it for common oscillators. Um, and uh, when we be back, we will be back. All right, be right back. <laughs>